Hi guys, so for lecture 2, we are going to learn on pronunciations. We call it Han Yu Pin Yin. Han Yu means Mandarin Chinese, Pin Yin means spelling. So we have three parts for Mandarin, which is extra one compared to English because we have tone here. So this, for example, on how we write it consonants, vowel, and tones. Remember, tone is very important because different tones have different meaning, and tone will never change except for special cases. We we'll go through about this later on. Okay, the first step we are going to learn on vowels, and we have six vowels. If you know Malay, it's very beneficial for you because the first five are like Malay exactly. Okay, first vowel we pronounce as ah as if you are going to see dentist right how are you going to open your mouth as big as possible so you will pronounce as ah second we pronounce as oh is that the chicken sounds in the morning oh 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 next one we pronounce as uh uh it's like when you are thinking deep thinking about something you may sound like uh uh mm, oh okay next one we pronounce as e e your mouth should should be bought as broad as possible. E showing your teeth. Next one. Ooh. Is that how the train sounds? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Last one. This special vowel because we have double dot above it. Okay, let me show you. This one, we have two baby steps on how to pronounce this vowel. First step. We pronounce as second step. Okay, there are only two steps to pronounce this. Okay, you can follow after me. U E U. Okay, so this is the pronunciations for this vowel. Okay, we do it one more time. U E U. As if the U and I combine together, okay, blend together. That's why the dot is here now. Okay. Actually, it's like English. It's English. U. Okay. But if you think logically, letter by letter, it shouldn't be pronounced as U. This one should pronounce as Yo Wu. Correct? Because Yo Yo. Okay. Never mind. So there are two steps on how to pronounce this one. As if you are learning English for the first time. First step is Y I U. Second is Y U. So we will pronounce as Y U. Y U. Okay, second word you pronounce faster. Y U. Y U. Correct? So actually it's the other way around. Mandarin is Y U I. English is Y I U. The most important thing for these two pronunciations, your mouth shape should be round shape. It's like, okay, see my mouth. How do I pronounce this vowel? Yi, yi. Okay, you can repeat after me. Yi. Okay, very good. If you know German, this vowel sounds like German. Okay. Okay, so far so good. Okay, next part we are going to learn on the tones. We have five tones in total. The fifth tone is just neutral or light tone. For example, good morning. There's no tone, it's just neutral, light, short tone. That's why we only focus on the first four tones. And we can summarize all these four tones into a graph so that you can differentiate it clearly. 
The first tone is high flat. As in English, we will say hi. Hi, John. If I say as hi, John, it may it may seem that I have problem and John may run away from me. Correct. So this one, first tone is high flat. It's like English hi. So we take this vowel for example. We pronounce as ah. You can use your hand gesture to indicate the tone. So first tone is high flat. So put your hands up as high as possible and flat. Ah, you can repeat after me. Ah, very good. Second tone is rising tone. In English, we will say what, ha. All our body parts and our tones are rising up. So for this vowel, we pronounce as ah. It's like a Nike symbol going up. Ah. The third tone is the opposite of first tone. First tone is high flat. Third tone is low flat. This one sounds like a man voice. Okay. Where are we going to have dinner tonight? Hi dear, I miss you. Okay, for example, uh, it sounds like very depressed. Okay, tired tone. English is like, uh, what should I have for tonight? Okay, you are thinking, deep thinking. So, for this vowel, we pronounce as. Ah, uh, repeat after me. Ah, uh, so you can put your hand as low as possible. If possible, touch the ground. Okay. The last tone, fourth tone, is the opposite of second tone. Second tone is going up. Fourth tone is going down. Fourth tone is a short and powerful tone. It's like you achieve something great in your life. You will say yes. Okay. For this vowel. We pronounce as ah, okay. Or you are hurt by someone, you will say ouch, okay. So one more time, repeat after me. Ah, very good. So we will practice for all these vowels, okay. You can repeat after me. Ah, ah. Ah, ah, oh, 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 uh, 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 uh. Okay, very good. If you're not sure, you can use your hand to indicate the tone. Okay, initially use your hand to help you. After that, you can just put your hand behind you. Okay. So we will learn the consonants for the next video. Stay tuned.